Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Alex, the comic Order. Thank you so much for clicking play on this video. In this video, I'm gonna show you five X-Men keys that I recently bought. I'm really excited about adding these ones to the collection. Hopefully you guys are excited about this one. Here we go. This video is sponsored by the Shortbox app. It's the easiest and safest way to buy and sell graded comic books online. There's a link in the description below that lets them know that I've sent you to download the app. So download it for Apple or Android devices and start shopping today. I bought these X-Men books from two different sellers. The first one I bought out of a storage unit, which is really an exciting storage unit purchase for me. Uh, I ended up paying quite a bit for a very few amount of books, but I ended up probably netting if I were to sell everything, about $770, spent $1,000 on some really cool Bronze Age books. But like I said, the value was closer to $2,000 or $1,700 if you want to be exact. The first set is from that seller, so I'll show those. The first one is X-Men number 102, and this is the first battle between Colossus and Juggernaut. I love these early new team issues. I think they're fantastic. This one's before John Byrne, I believe. I believe this is Dave Cockrum cover and art. Yep. And so really great stuff here. This is X-Men number 102. I've got this one graded at a fine plus 6.5 and I have the value of this comic book at $60 in that condition. So really nice key. It can go for a lot more than $60. It can go upwards of, you know, $150, $200. All right. The next book up is X-Men number 103. And this is another Dave Cockrum cover. Really great early X-Men new team. Love the cover. You've got Juggernaut and you've got Nightcrawler, Banshee. I love Banshee. I love that character Banshee. And you got Storm. Really, really great cover. This In this issue, you hear Wolverine called Logan for the very first time. I have this one graded at a fine plus 6.5. Once again, $60 value, but this one can go up words of 100 to 125 bucks. All right, and the last one that I'll show from that group from the storage unit sale, um, this one's X-Men number 106. This is from 1977, great cover. Once again, Dave Cockrum art. It's got Colossus, Nightcrawler, Storm being blasted by Cyclops's rays there. Really cool. The angel is back and he's come to murder the new X-Men. That's awesome. Really, really great cover. I've got this one at a fine to very fine 7.0. And I have this one valued at $40. I think this is a really cool key because it's got the first appearance of Entity, which is the dark side of Professor Xavier. So this is a really cool book. Love the cover. Like I said, love this new team and the early stories for the new team. All right, I got these next one from That Comic Book Guy on Instagram. Really great seller, Sean. I'm trying to maybe sell him a lot of books here um, in the new year. So hopefully he's, he's excited to possibly buy a lot of my books so I can get into something different. Uh, um, another, maybe another big holy grail or something, but I'm trying to consolidate once again. But I bought two books from him and I'm really excited about these books. I've owned these books before, but I was really excited to get these back. This is Chris Claremont and John Byrne Goodness. This is X-Men number 141 from 1980. This is part one of Days of Future Past. And I paid $100 for both of these books from that comic book guy on Instagram. This is a great book. It's got a lot of, so I'm just going to read all the, the keynotes from this book. It's the first team appearance of the Brotherhood of Evil Mutants, Mystique, Destiny, Pyro, Avalanche, and Blob. It's the first appearance of Destiny, Avalanche, Pyro, and Rachel Summers, the daughter of Scott and Jean Grey. Cool book. Love it. Happy to have this. And thank you so much to that comic book guy. Definitely follow him on Instagram. He's got a lot of great books. He's always got really good deals, very fair pricing, and he's a great guy. All right, next one up, as you could imagine, the Uncanny X-Men number 142 from 1980. This is the death of everybody. This is Days of Future Past Part 2. Death of Wolverine, Colossus, and Storm in the alternate reality, retitled from X-Men to Uncanny X-Men, officially in the Indicia uh, copyright section. So actually, I'll talk about the grades and the values on these two. The Part 1, so the 141, I graded that at a very fine 8.0 valued at about $70. Like I said, I paid $100 for both of them. So that's about right. This 142, you can get this book for, for somewhat cheap, probably valued it at $30. It's a fine plus 6.5. So I think $100 is very, very fair on that. Five awesome keys, really cool, early X-Men, new team, and then a really great storyline 
with the days of future past. So hopefully you guys really enjoyed this. If you're brand new to the channel, hit that subscription button, hit that bell to be notified when there's future videos. And with that being said, you guys, I will talk to you all on the next one. See you, bye.